This isn't gonna be a typical Christmas room. If that's not proof that God exists, I don't know what is. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I've been inspired. You guys remember my Halloween room? It's October 31st. I'm really sad about this one though, because I love my roses. We had a Halloween party and had to take all the decorations out and use them for the party. So my room, up until now, has been uh, nothing, boring, and kind of a wreck. So we're gonna do a ultimate Christmas room. Now the inspiration I have for this room is I want to do a winter wonderland, I want to do snow, a personal flurry, I want to do reindeer, and I want to do a Christmas tree. So I have lots and lots of ideas swirling around my head, but we're gonna go shopping and get all the finalized things that we need for this one. Yes, you do. Well, they're just kind of big and baggy, you know? Ooh, the lighting's really good right here. Yes. Y'all, look at those, they're frosted covered. Oh, frosted is like the thing for me. Not that I know of, I don't think they do. Okay, do you know where I could get them though? Like Home Depot or something? Yeah, probably. Or like Lowe's or something, because they typically are outdoor oh. lights. Yeah, okay, thank you, yeah. So I need to find some kind of really light tree that I can hang from the ceiling upside down because that's something that I've wanted to do for a long time. And uh, yeah, actually, I can second that. I've wanted to do it for so long. But I don't actually, I don't know, like, because those would be too heavy. <gasps> oh, that's so... Oh my, oh my gosh, what if we did like, what if we did like this one? Because it's tall, so it looks so good hanging upside down. <laughs> Suck. I'm quaking. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I think this is right actually, I don't know. Yeah, that looks right. I think. It's so long, I love it. I know. Perfectly. Got to reassemble some things. You sound like a Minecraft like, villager. No, why did that sound like the Grinch? <laughs> this is turning out wild. Imagine this tree, guys, right here, hanging upside down from my ceiling with LED cloud lights around it. It's gonna be the coolest Christmas room. I have so much creative energy right now. <laughs> This is all our stuff. You know, go big or go home when it comes to Christmas, you guys. We haven't even started yet. This is only the first store that we're going in. Man, if I didn't have muscles, you would be screwed. Just to get started on the Christmas miracle spirit, something crazy just happened. Okay. Annie and I were at Target, clearly, and we got to the checkout, and our price was $231, right? So Annie actually forgot her card at home, which has like most of the funds that we use for video. And I just had my card, but I swiped it, and it wouldn't work like three times, and we were like, uh, what do we do? And it just so happened that my grandpa, who's here from London for two weeks, somehow how someone was at the checkout literally right next to us. And I looked over and I was like, Grandpa! Grandpa. And he was like, what? What are y'all doing here? Like, we didn't even know like each other were coming to Target. And then Grandpa was like, here, I'll pay for it. And we were like, we'll pay you back. If he wasn't there. I know, cause, cause you don't ever got out of my card. This video would have been a fail. Oh my gosh. Wow, Christmas miracles, guys. Look at We're definitely gonna find a life-size reindeer. A reindeer. That's so pretty. We gotta see him and then we'll name him. Yeah? Oh, wait, look. For my clouds. <laughs> you coming? I was like pulling it and all of them were attached. <laughs> look at those. Those are so cool. All this Christmas stuff. <laughs> like New Year's is my favorite holiday, hands down, but Christmas is still pretty fun. <laughs> look at these. I literally have like one of these. It's so cute. Oh. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> I love Christmas decorations. Ooh, look at these. This is ridiculous. Look at all the stuff that we purchased. Now the rest of my room is an absolute wreck. So what I'm gonna start doing is I'm gonna start taking out the stuff that I definitely don't need, plus rearranging the room in a way where that I think is going to be good. This is really heavy. Let's play a quick little game. I wanna see if you guys can like this video and subscribe to this channel before I move my bed completely. So one, two, three, go! Did you do it? If you subscribe to this channel, I like this video before I finished moving my bed. Kneecap doesn't believe that you did it. But let me know in the comment section. So this bad boy right here is a Christmas tree that I had last year and I think I'm going to move it over there beside my bed to fill up this corner. Before I do that, I need to take the scary bats off the wall. Man, I stuck these on real good. Nice. This 
guy's name is Christopher. And he is so cute. He's gonna go right over there next to that snowy tree that I got at Target yesterday. See, look, it's like its own little atmosphere. In this corner, I'm going to put my Christmas tree. You okay? Yeah. And he's trying to get storage boxes out. <laughs> Wait. You got it? But oh, you do have that pillow. Oh my goodness. Oh no. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Did it break your nail? No, I don't have nails. Oh. Okay, love that for Annie. I am going to put the Christmas tree in this corner. We're going to do something really cool and really fancy to it, but first I actually need to set it up. So we're gonna do that. I realize I don't actually know how to do this. Problem is, with this stuff though, the snow is getting all over me. Last part. It works! So something that I love doing is I've done this in every Christmas room, even before I was on YouTube. I used to get a pole and I would attach thread to it and then I would hang snowflakes from that thread. I got my friend Emma to come help me decorate the room. She is setting up the reindeer. <laughs> yeah, he's a bit decapitated right now, but that's okay. There we go, see? They're all gonna hang like that. <laughs> Do, do, do. Oh, okay, yes. I gotta like get it perfectly balanced. Yay! Yes. Hey, there Snowflakes. we go. Snowflakes. Those are cute. It's all coming together. <laughs> kind of only this corner. What are we cooking, Lily? We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna be cooking polar bear and fern with frost on it. It's gonna be really delicious. And then our brave soldier is gonna just attach it there so it makes it a little cloud with little flurries. It's so dainty and quaint. So now is the fun part. Mom, mom, what are you doing right here? I am making um, some kind of hook. Yeah. Basically like a noose for the tree. Something that I have dreamed of doing, I've always, always, always wanted to do this, is clouds hanging from my ceiling and finally I'm getting to do that! Using the paper lanterns to glue fluff onto them. And they're gonna hang those from the ceiling and they're going to be the most awesome clouds you have ever seen in your life. Looks like mom has a handle. Wonder what that's for. Oh my god. Look goodness. at it. Oh, that's so good. Awesome. I love it. This is like my childhood dream coming true. It's very slowly coming together. Doesn't look too much like a dead body. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be so covered in snow after this. Oh, yeah, it worked! It's oh really especially like a dead body. Well, once it's light up. I want to do this for years. Yay! Yay! It's so cute. Oh my gosh. I've wanted to do this for so long in my oh, life. Oh, that looks so cute. Oh my gosh. Now we have so many more to do. <laughs> That's the only thing. That's cute. Booty bump. Oh no! No! <laughs> Me and Lily were talking last night and I was like, oh yeah, I'm probably going to use like the white carpet for my bedroom, which is in the living room, as you can see. And then Lily said, oh, I was planning on using that as well. So like civil men, we're going to settle this in a great, interesting way. We're going to be playing some rock, paper, scissors to see who gets the white carpet in the living room. <laughs> okay, wait, hang on, what am I going to do? This is so tense. This is a big deal. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> That's not what I was planning. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. Paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> Best two out of three. Oh, not three out of two. <laughs> what? <laughs> never mind, never mind. Okay, okay. Rock, Rock paper, scissors. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Dang. Yes! Okay, you got one. I have one! <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. So we're one for one. One to one. Whoever wins the last one gets the rug. Gets the rug. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, Rock paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. We go into my brain tomb for a little bit. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. No! Yeah! <laughs> <Rick>! <laughs> right, uh, that was the most stressful thing I've ever- Lily really won the carpet. I clearly have not vacuumed this rug in forever. It's like snow on the ground. Everybody, this is it. Believe it or not, this room took four days to complete. One day of shopping, one day of organizing everything, one day of construction, and then one day of finishing it. It took literally so long, and I'm so excited that it's done, okay. But before we actually go into the room, make sure you guys subscribe to this channel. Make sure you comment down below if you're excited to see the room, and while you're at it, just give this video a thumbs up. So I'll give you a few seconds to do that while I stand here. Okay, that should probably be done by now, and if it's not, well, you're honestly missing out because there's lots of stuff like this, but let's go in. Don't mind the uh, construction area. 
Uh, I'm gonna clean that up at some point, but this is my improved Christmas room. <laughs> Do you guys like it? It is absolutely exactly what I imagined it would be. We're gonna start at this side of the room. Obviously, we have our upside down Christmas tree hanging from the ceiling. We have little snowflakes, we have some snowballs, and we have some regular ornaments. Now, if you step over to the side, we have, uh, we have... What's his name? Gladimir. We have Grimaldi over here. We have a life-size reindeer. He has his own little patch of snow, his own personal flurry. But speaking of patches of snow, we have this rug that I valiantly fought <laughs> for. Dude. And I'm proud to say I have uh, gained the cash prize. So then if you pan up here, we have my bed, which is obviously just white and snowy. And on the back, as you guys know, in my Halloween room, we did the rose headboard with the black roses. So I wanted to continue that theme because I really liked it. So I did snowy ferns. And then I have my own personal floor because above me, we have my own clouds. And while you guys were gone, we added two baby clouds. Aren't they just so cute? Little baby clouds. And then over here, we have Christopher. We have some snowy leaves. Then we have my little nook, and then we have Emma's snowbank up here, one of my favorite parts. And then over this side of the bed, my bedside table with my phone charger. But we have this super crazy Christmas tree that I got last year, because last year I was talking to myself and I was like, I don't actually want a regular Christmas tree. So I have a abnormal Christmas tree and an extremely abnormal Christmas tree. But you know, what about me is actually normal. So I hope you guys love the room. Now we're gonna get reactions from my family. That's so cool. Mom's a genius, that's how. Wow! <laughs> Look at the tree! Yeah, that's amazing. Oh my goodness, it's like a snow forest. Yeah. Wow. I love it. Do you like it, Marky? I've never seen anything there. Oh, that's yes. amazing. 